Hey there, YouTube. It's Math Bowler. Welcome to my mainline autograph show purchase recap video. This is my second of at least eight of these recap videos from the mainline autograph show that was held at the Monroeville Convention Center May 20th, 21st, 22nd, 2002. I went on Friday and Saturday, the 20th and 21st. This video has my items that are not autograph lines, not autograph purchases, not trading card purchases. These are my more miscellaneous purchases and I'll go ahead and show them in the order with which I purchased them. There's not a whole lot to show you as far as items but there's some cool ones. In my game use baseball collection I bought this from my buddy Rick. It's a Bach. I do not have a Bach and I do now and this is not a Pirates player or it wasn't in a, at a Pirates game but the pitcher Wade LeBlanc was a Pirate so I thought, well, if I'm going to add a Bach to the collection on the cheap, a former pirate, that would work, 30 bucks. He hooks me up with good deals, so that was excellent. That was a nice purchase for the Game Used Baseball Collection. And from the same seller, I actually did not pay that. He gave me a great deal of 40 or $20. 71 World Series. They had a baseball commemorating the 71 World Series. He got this during batting practice. You can tell it was mudded up. It was probably one that wasn't used during the game and end up in a BP bin and oh my gosh, that is heartbreaking. I had to rescue this baseball. The logo's beat up, but a signature underneath would still look well. I had to save this baseball. I saw it and I'm like, that's, that's heartbreaking. Who would do that? And when he gave me a deal on that, I wasn't going to say no. That made up my mind real easily. Well, I bought a case of top loaders. Mm-hmm. And the price was right. I'm actually going to bust the seal on this because... I even said to the seller, I said, you know, was this, you know, damaged or anything? Like, you know, I've bought a case before where all the top loads were all kind of mangled a bit. Because there may have been a lot of weight on it. So I said, no, these ones are, they should, these, these are fine. So, we're going to find out. Ta-da! Forty packs of Ultra Pro top loaders. Wonderful. I had bought one case in the past, and you know, there must have been a ton of weight, and they were all smushed, and they were all had a bit of warpage to them. But I can't tell by inspecting them. I mean, you take them out of the package, you can tell then. But uh, one hundred twenty-five dollars. I'm not joking. One hundred twenty-five dollars. I didn't believe the price. I wasn't intending on buying top loaders, but I sure was this situation. All right, so two more things to show you. When I got there, I went to the one person in the past who had sold some frames, 16 by 20 frames, hoping that he would have some, and he said and he did not. Later on at the show, I saw a seller who was making them actually making the frames so I got my vertical Pittsburgh Steelers 16 by 20 it's got the double matting got the logo there very cool and my photo for that is this Greg Lloyd 16 by 20 TSE Authenticate. I purchased this on the cheap a while ago of Greg Lloyd. <laughs> I wasn't hired for my disposition. Uh, good stuff. And then I got this Pittsburgh Penguins horizontal 16 by 20. 
custom frame made for the HBK line when they won their Stanley Cup this was like the amazing third line <laughs> Phil Kessel Nick Benino, Carl Haglin, HBK, and Benino inscribed at HBK and Vine. Oh, that was some good stuff right there, and now I can frame these babies up. So, those were two nice big purchases. These were $60 a frame. So, there's some money in this video, but hey, there's going to be money in all these videos. So, thank you for checking this out. This was my second of at least eight aftermath videos from the mainline autograph show let me know in the comments below what you think i upload three videos a week i would appreciate if you would like comment subscribe to my channel i do a ttm video on mondays and an autograph and or trading card video such as this on wednesdays and saturdays take care everybody